Hello, I'm Lindsay Armstrong with your City of Culture news. We begin with the launch of the Lumiere Festival, a highlight of our City of Culture year, which takes place next month. Lumiere will weave a trail of art and light throughout the city, from the fountain to the bog side and from Ebrington to the city walls. The organisers say that we've never seen anything quite like it. Buildings will change shape and appearance and human forms will seem to fly through the air. And coming up this Saturday, the Millennium Forum is the venue for Gym Fusion. This colourful blend of gymnastics and dance is guaranteed to wow the audience. Start time is 1 o'clock on Saturday and tickets are £7.50 and £2 cheaper for under 14s and seniors. You can also head down to the Craigan to see artist Lockie Morris's exhibition entitled A Week in Goals. A former barber shop is the venue in the heart of the community where Lockie grew up and his art depicts gritty representations of life in the area during the Troubles. It's open now until Saturday evening. And if you want to get a taste of the birth of rock and roll in 1950s Soho, then check out Bunny's Vendetta at the Glassworks. This black comedy takes us inside the bitter rivalries between songwriter, performer and publicist and features a live band, The Moonstones. Tickets are £8.50 and the play runs until Tuesday. And finally, ahead of the opening of the Turner Prize exhibition, a new campaign has been launched aimed at bringing this contemporary art to a new audience. React will tour across Ireland in their mobile studio, reaching the City of Culture next Tuesday. Well, that's your City of Culture news for this week. Have a great weekend.